Look at that fine piece. Lego action right there. This is just a miniature quick vlog thing. <laughs> I guess kind of on par with one of LGR's blurbs maybe more. But I just wanted to show you some things. So this is actually my, well I might as well just show it real quick. This is the crown jewel of my Lego set. Anybody who knows Legos is going to know exactly what this is. You might notice that the actual part is missing, and I have it, it's just this is the display model because I still wanted to use the actual monorail engine in that, so this is just kind of the original set, uh, <laughs> put on blocks I guess you would say because I pulled the track and everything out too because track is $20 per piece, so, but anyway that's not, that's not what I want to show you, what I want to show you is, I was talking about it in my Mario Brothers 3 thing, or playthrough, uh, let's play, and I was talking about my CD player here. This is my record player I just got too, but this is my CD player that I got, and it mostly works. It needs to probably be cleaned. I'm gonna go buy a disc cleaner today. And so I have it hooked up to my stereo, or my receiver here. So I want to show you this. So what you do, is let's turn on our receiver, of course. Let's see a little blue light that shows music optimization. It's optimizer. But the main thing is the CD player. So it's a six disc player, and I'm still waiting on the actual six disc cartridge to show up. This is like the shotgun of CD players, and I'll show you why. So, <clears throat> you pull out, or you eject it, right? There isn't a tray, this is the, I mean, like other ones, I guess there is a tray. Other trays are kind of like, you just, this part's all empty because the laser is underneath. <coughs> um and all that, but this isn't that way. In fact, look at this. So you can do different cartridges in here, and then this, the laser is uh, actually up top, and so you play it upside down. But I mean, <clears throat> this is, I, I had never seen this. Anybody who's older than me, I'm sure this is completely, like, just regular everyday stuff to you, but to me it wasn't. So you can have this one, which is the single disc tray, cartridge thing or you have the six disc one and that's why you have these six buttons over here that do nothing with the one I've got in there. This is cool too, right? You get the little headphone thing. But so what we're going to do is I'll show you. So you stick the cartridge in like that. Then we're going to put in our CD which is Curves Pubic Fruit. It goes upside down and you, it's like that, right? It's just ka -chunk. You could do it the other way too. You could <laughs> lock and load and do it that way. But I like to do it this way because it just feels like you're just chunk it up, you know. And then the track that I wanted to play, I think, was four. Now, why didn't I hit this play button? Because that's the random play button. So, yeah. This was also the song that I was talking about with my lucid dream thing. I had a hankering to go listen to it today. A hankering? What am I, like 50? Also, this CD player, like I said, needs to be clean because it obviously isn't even working. Sometimes it likes to play, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it starts tracks at like 20 seconds in, 12 seconds in. I gotta I gotta clean it up. But anyway, I just wanted to show that to you with the the shotgun loading. So, yeah, enjoy.